it all actually applies to a humanoid robot. It's the same techniques. It's just a robot with arms. Bro! And a robot with, with wheels. And uh, we've made a lot of progress with uh, Optimus. And uh, as you can see, we... But we there is no suit, one in that. Um, ...in a robot suit. Uh, sort of down. And then we've progressed tr dramatically year after year. So if you extrapolate this, you're really going to have <laughs> something spectacular. Something that anyone could own. Um, so you could have your own personal... And I think at scale, the, the you know, this would cost something like, I don't know, twenty, thirty thousand dollars $30,000. Probably less, less than a car. What? In long term. Now, you know, it'll take us a minute to get to the long term. But, um, but fundamentally, at scale, uh, the Optimus robot, you should be able to, to buy an Optimus robot for, I think, probably twenty to $30,000 long term. So, what? And, and what can it do? It can, it'll be able to do anything you want. So it can um, be a teacher, babysit your kids, it can walk your dog, mow your lawn, get the groceries, just be your friend, serve drinks. Um, Whoa. Whatever you can think of, it will do. And yeah, it's gonna be awesome. And I, I, I think this will be the biggest product ever of any kind. This is crazy. That's mind blowing that those are not humans. We're actually going to live long enough to see self driving cars and robot assistants. <laughs> A cowboy robot. This is so sick. These people can't even believe it. Look at look at that lady's face. It's like like talking to the people without being able to speak it's giving out goodie bags He did not just... What is... He's playing rock, paper, scissors? What is... What's he trying to say? He's literally trying to communicate. That is wild. When's the system update where they're able to speak? Oh, he's actually gonna, like, turn on the water? Legit? No way. What happens if somebody spills water on one of those? What is that? So, like, that would be... Quite fantastic. Oh, and uh, also, what 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 happens if you need a vehicle that uh, is bigger than a Model Y? So that's supposed to be a, a limo. The the Robovan. The Robovan is. Uh, this is a, we're going to make this, and it's going to look like that. 
Now, can you what? imagine going down the streets and you see this coming towards you? That'd be sick. So this can, this can carry up to 20 people and it can also uh, transport goods. So you can configure it for goods transport within a city uh, or transport of up to 20 people at a time. So this is gonna, <laughs> the Revoven is what's gonna solve for high density. So if you, if you want to take a sports team somewhere or um, you're looking to, to really uh, get uh, the cost of travel down to, I don't know, five, 10 cents a mile, then you can use the Revoven. Some people call it the Robovan, but uh... <laughs> so yeah. Who would have like ever thought that we'd even see this in our lifetime?